Hello, this is Case Casual here, and so I would like to show you how I was able to activate Windows. Uh, I had Windows 10 activated already, or, yeah, I had it activated already, but for some reason this watermark popped at the bottom right, which I actually removed already. And so, what I found was you can use a Windows activator that I, that I found on Mediafire. So, here, I'll just show you. So, you go, go on um, the internet, yeah, just go on a browser, and uh, put in the link that's in the description. I put a link to Mediafire in the description, and so what you do is you download this. You download this, get your software here, and what it's going to give you is exactly what's in here. Now what you're going to do is you're going to extract, get your software here, to the desktop. Now if anything worries you about like viruses or anything else like that, uh, don't worry because there is, there are none. There is none, no. <laughs> but yeah, there are none. There are no viruses in this. Uh, none that I have found. I scanned it. There was nothing. And it should just go straight through. And so here, I'll show you. So these are the two files that come out of the Get Your Software Here. So the serial text, you can use this one for professional. And you can use this one for Windows Home. Uh, 10 Home. And also to note, um... I haven't tried this on any other Windows versions. You can try, but I don't know for sure. There's a there's a there's a chance that this would work on others, but I would stick with the theory that it only works with the Windows Windows 10. I searched for a while and this is what I found. So anyways, go on here. Um, I have Windows 10 Home, so I would copy this. And then you can open up the well actually here, cancel out of that. Actually, go ahead and actually open this in Administrator. So, run as Administrator. Yes. And... This pops up. So, you can use a code for um, Office, Windows, like Office. And you can use it for Windows. So, I'm just going to go Windows. And so, the first thing you do is you go into the activation right here. And you press, um, it's already on here, but you press Install. It's not here right now, but you press install. And so when the, once this installs, you go to the product key, you press this enter custom key, and you put in that code, whichever one you used for the uh, serial.txt. So you put that in, and then you press install. Leave it as Windows v uh, Vista. Don't worry about that. That's That shouldn't matter. And then once that installs, which it'll go through here, and it'll say, you know, that it, it completed, you can go back to uh, the activator and press EZ activator and so once you do that any watermark you have for the Windows 10 should just automatically just disappear that's exactly what happened for me and uh, if you need a if, if you think that you need some help uh, I can you know put some I can I can throw down some comments uh, about exactly how how to do it if uh, you need any more assistance but that's about exactly how you would do it you know, you just, you uh, you go through, you install the auto KM, KMS, which on the activation tab, then you go to product key, you put in the product key by pressing enter custom key, and then you uh, install it, leaving it at Windows Vista, uh, Vista, and then you go back here and press easy activator. Simple as that. So, yeah, that's it. Um, yeah, I can show you exactly activation. And it should show me that it's activated. Um, yep, it's activated. Right there, Windows, to Windows 10 Home. And if you would have looked in any of my other videos, it would have a watermark. Not any of them, but many of the videos would have a watermark. So now this opens up quite a few um, things for me. But yeah, that's a super quick way to do it. And it just takes time in the areas of installing and letting it go through the little um, loading screens. But that's about it. So anyways, thanks for watching and I'll see you guys in the <laughs> I'll see you guys in the next video.